my god, walking out here right now is absolutely terrible. What's up guys, welcome back to another exciting episode of Fishing More Outdoors. Today, just like last video, we have myself, we got my brother Ryan, and we have our our new buddy Scott from uh, 330 Maniac. And in this video, we are going to be hopefully catching some, some pretty good sized crappies, so. Stay tuned, uh, these guys are gonna get all these holes drilled. I'm gonna sit here and look stupid, and uh, yeah, hopefully we can catch some fish. So stay tuned guys, you won't be pissed. I lied, you might be a little pissed. Ow. Hooked up. Nope. Oh no, we got a crappie. A little crappie. Come here, keep this little guy right? Uh, no. No? Too small. Alright. Well, that's a good sign. Hopefully, we can get a few more like that. Ooh, this one's better. A lot better. This might be a bluegill. Yep, that's exactly what it is. Decent little bluegill. That's sweet. A little mixed batch. Perfecto. Still speaking Spanish. No! I ripped his lips. No! Over. Oh, yeah. Got him. A lot better than the first one, I'm thinking. This actually feels like a decent sized crappie. Oh, it's a bass. Jesus, if I can grab him, just a little bass. That's funny. That makes me wonder if that's what that first fish was that hit me. Although it did feel like a big crappie. Alright buddy, come on. He's all wrapped up in the line. Let him go, let him grow. Let him grow to be a big old five pound bucket mouth. Oh, he's got a buddy coming up. This one looks a little bit smaller. Might be a crappie though. Or a bluegill. I don't think this is a bluegill. Yep. Decent little bluegill. Boy, they sure are fat this time of year. Oh, come on, bud. Oh, yeah, here we go. Got him. This is a crappie. This is big. This might be a bass. If it's a crappie, it's huge. Yep, that was a bass. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I suck. Tiny. Very tiny. Wow, this is my day. Tanker. Tanker. Alright, time to move on. Totally wrong. It's a little crappie. Not a bad little crappie at that. Go let them grow. So maybe these are all crappies. Houston, we have uh, some racers. A cobra. Sound effects with Murda. This one's a little bit better. Just a little bit. Not a lot better. 
Just a... I'm done. I quit. Okay, let's try this again. Houston, we have a racer. <laughs> it's another bluegill. Oh yeah. Another bluegill. Decent one though. Not bad at all. Alright, I wanna see a crappie now. I'm done with the bluegills. Bring me a crappie. Yeah. Tiny. Again. Tiny, tiny, tiny. Time to move on once again. Got him. Another bluegill. Unreal. <laughs> yeah, I know. I suck at fishing. What's it to you? Another bluegill. Ooh, that's actually not a bad one. Eh. Decent little bluegill. Decent little bluegill. I like it the bluegills. Oh yeah, little, a couple little ones, bluegills, grabbers. I've caught like 15 crappies so far, and they've all been smaller than I've ever caught them before. Really? I don't know why. Oh yeah, here we go. Got a couple of racers competing. Not big though. Not big. Oh, it's a crappie though. It's a targeted species. Uh, I hate the graph. We're gonna new graph next year. A fancy one. This looks like a really nice mark. Please hit me. This is not. This is not a crappie. <gasps> hit it. Come on, buddy. No. Come on. Uh, It suck. Just suck in air. Just hang it up. Sell my stuff. If you guys want to buy my ice fishing gear, comment down below and I will uh I, you know what? I don't even need to sell it. I'll just give it I'll just give you it. So if you want all my fishing stuff, comment down below. You can have it. Oh biggin. 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 I am the best fisherman in the world that's ever lived. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come at me, bro. <laughs> Bum! Dude, I put a short cruise crazy critter on. Keep it? Alright. Well, as you guys seen, I'm the best fisherman to ever live, known to man, so yeah, write that down. Take a picture. Do what you need to do. And there you go. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Holy shit! Yeah. <laughs> Ryan just got a got a donkey. I'm using a shrimp axe. A half a shrimp axe. Oh boy. This looks like a nice crappie. It's racing too. Yep. Oh, maybe not. I think this is a bluegill. Holy crap. He's digging. Yeah, that's a freaking stud. Look at that. That's a stud of a bluegill. Holy buckets. Ba -ba Bam. That's a freaking tanker. Very respectable. Bye bye. Oh. This is kind of fun. Nice bass. Ryan's on the bass.
Well, as you guys may be just seen, I left my camera behind at that last hole, went to a couple other holes, and I fought a pike for all the way up to the hole, and broke me off. Tough luck. I suck. Oh. Now my line just fell through all of my guides. What the frick? Ice fishing's so much fun. <laughs> all right, dudes, just in case you guys are curious, I am using right here that is the juice for crappies and apparently bluegills these are the euro tackle shrimp axes and these things are by far my favorite bait for crappies they are very durable very sexy looking and i'm going to uh i'm just gonna i'm using a, a four millimeter jig so i am gonna pinch off half of the body of this little shrimp axe and once you do that, it looks like this. Hopefully you can see that. And crappies absolutely love them. And so do I. So let's go catch some. <sighs> I really don't know why I sat down and started fishing that hole again. Because I just lost a pike there. God, walking here sucks. God damn, boy. What am I even saying? Who am I? This feels decent. Oh, 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 oh it's because it is decent. That's a good one. Well, I definitely think uh, I think we're gonna end it on this fish. The bite, the bite here, honestly, has not been too crazy, but we did catch some pretty decent crappies. I caught one really nice crappie. Ryan caught one nice, actually Ryan caught like three really nice crappies and and I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure Scott caught a couple decent ones too. So if you guys could go down here, like this video, go share the crap with this video, go smash that subscribe button and you guys gotta start fishing more. And also you guys should go, go subscribe to my, my good buddy Scott at uh, 330 Maniac. I will once again leave his link down in the description. And yeah, I hope you guys are pumped that I'm back from Mexico. I plan on doing a lot of fishing, probably not right away. Well, maybe I might go do some traveling and fish out of my boat, but uh, the ice fishing in Minnesota is not looking that good. So bye guys.